Hey, it's Johnny. Gonna look at the three in one photo lens kit, the Amir three in one photo lens kit. Get up a focal distance of half inch, so you can get up to a half inch close, 13 millimeters, for some amazing 25 time macro shots. So we'll test out that macro shot. That's kind of what I'm interested in. Um, approximately 180 degrees field of view screws onto the macro lens as a precision set. Once we'll do the fish eye, and then wide angle, super wide, maximum angle, 145 degree high quality triple image effect. So let's get one of these out. Here's the set. Comes in like a semi hard case. Pouch, soft. Kind of a. I don't know how to explain. Not a plastic, but kind of a soft material, plush, vinyl material, uh, carabiner on a loop, a zipper, getting it opened up, Let's look at our three lenses, and a lens cloth, cleaning cloth. So let's get the lenses out and see what we got. Okay, here's the macro lens. See if we can get a better look at it. 25 by macro. Has a little lens cap on it. Plastic clip, spring clip. This will go on to your, your camera's facing that way, that'll go on to the lens. So your screen will be um, back like towards us. And there's the lens cap coming off of it. And you get this set up. Okay, when the macro lens gets clipped on, this is what you're seeing. You're seeing a bunch of blurry stuff. You're not going to be able to focus your hand a foot out. you got to put something right up here to the lens. And once you touch this plastic ring around the lens, that's where it's set. And this is a coin. It's a foreign coin. But it just gives you an idea on the power of that macro. And how we can how it really focuses in on small detail. Of course, there's my finger. That'll give you a good idea on the macro. The other side of the coin. As long as you got a light source, you'll be able to see real good with the macro. And you can take pictures like this. You know, just like this. Now, here's the fish eye set. We'll try it by itself. And this is a metal uh, housing around these lenses. So we'll get this hooked up. Do you see that? See how close we are to this table? Now watch. See how it does the fisheye effect, kind of balloons it out. It covers a real wide angle. Of course you can focus it. This kind of helps you toy with it. You can pick up more wide scenery in one shot. Kind of gives some special effects. Now it says this can be doubled onto the macro lens to do something. I'm going to mess with that and see if it does anything. Alright, I decided not even to try to mess with that. Putting the fisheye onto the macro lens, I didn't see how it goes on there and what effect it would give because your macro is super close up. So what would the fisheye do? I don't, I don't get it. This is the super wide angle lens. Trying to get it centered up on here. But you can see how it already backs it off. Gets you a little bit more wide of a picture. And it kind of covers a wider span compared to straight lens. See where we're looking? Now if we went to super wide angle, it really opens it up. You can get a lot more in it. And it'll all focus clear. So, on a closer picture, it really picks up so much more around you compared to your regular lens. So, these are real neat, well constructed, like I said, metal housings on these, like an aluminum. I guess it would be an aluminum housing. And your clips, that's what you're looking at. Pretty neat set.